is moving, moving forward, but we can't stop now. We're in competition with China and other countries to win the 21st century. We're at a great inflection point in history. We have to do more than just build back better. We, build back, we have to build back better. We have to compete more strenuously than we have. That means making sure every nation plays by the same rules in the global economy, including China. My discussions, in my discussion with President Xi, I told him, we welcome the competition. We're not looking for conflict. But I made absolutely clear that we will defend America's interest across the board. America will stand up to unfair trade practices and undercut American workers and American industries, like subsidies from state to state-owned operations and enterprises, and the theft of American technology and intellectual property. I also told President Xi that we'll maintain a strong military presence in the Indo-Pacific, just as we do with NATO and Europe not to start a conflict, but to prevent one. I told them what I've said to many world leaders, that America will not back away from our commitments, our commitment to human rights and fundamental freedoms and to our alliances. And I pointed out to him, no responsible American president could remain silent when basic human rights are being so blatantly violated. Do you have to say something that can't be said? Is there a different opinion that can't be said? Let's hear your thoughts from the young people. Let's hear your voice. 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 还有，别忘了订阅我们闹变风向的 YT 频道，按赞，开启小铃铛，就不会错过我们精彩的辩论哦。各位朋友，闹变风向，赶嘴就来变。